The giving out of certificates to pilgrims of Israel brought these individuals together. In the conference room of the Ministry of Foreign Affairs, the consul gave a word to some women who have been holding fast towards his gold. Aside going to see the birthplace of Jesus Christ, other reasons for the pilgrimage was revealed. You know, the base of the Christendom, we can say, is the death and the resurrection of Christ. So the consulate of Israel and God's own travel decided to come together and make this a reality that every Christian should go spend this special occasion of the Christendom on the Holy Land. This woman expresses a joy unto God for the success of the mission he placed on her. I give grace to God who has kept us through the journey to Israel because I go to Israel with the children of God every year. It is a special mission God gave me. I am very happy that every year we go there and come back joyfully. So glory be to God. Some pilgrims of the first and second edition shared their experiences. We have visited sites where the shepherd had yet known. We went to touch the star of nativity. After we did the station of the cross, we went to the lamentation wall and we pray. At every place we visited, we pray according to the event as during the time of Jesus Christ. Jesus Christ. I can't even describe what I saw because I've forgotten what I paid due to the things I saw there. According to God's own travel agency and Jesus stars, all, especially Christians, should make it a point to visit the Holy Land. I'm calling on every Christian out there to call God's own travel agency on this number 2132-2795. That is the, uh, the landline. And then the mobile, that is um, 9999-8149. It should recall that this is the realization of the call of God on the lives of these two women. The third edition of the Pilgrim to Israel will take place on 23rd to 30th March 2016. Before all moved to the table for their meal, many danced and nodded to the tunes of this brass band.